Yeah. I want to, like, stutter, like, left him. You know, apparently that, I don't need to get into it, but apparently that actually helps people with stutters to talk. Well, hearing hearing it back, like, uh, like I know a you're talking a second about delay. Yeah. yeah, but that helps people who have stutters naturally. Anyway. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's right. Okay, so Falco Ditto. God. His character. Basically, it's just who has better lasers and who can deal with lasers better. And who gets more off the shine. Mm. Wow. Oh. Oh. Interesting decision. No, I'm just kidding. I, I heard someone saying that Falco doesn't dash dance. Or he does dash dance, but he dash dance up and down. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's not as necessary for my feelings. But, yeah, know. Falco's like the best character at coming down, probably. Down air. Okay. You see, you can see these two Falcos are just full hop battling. Uh huh. I feel like they, people don't multi shine effectively as Falco anymore. Maybe it's not just as necessary. I feel like shine grab is really good. Mm. I don't see that very often. It's usually just laser grab. Electric laser. All right, this is wow. How this? There's no timer. Well, it's hopefully good. you need to memorize Randall Hardcore with no timer. Seriously. I wonder if uh, his movement and the uh, the elephant, you know the elephants? Apparently thing? it does. They do. There is some way to figure it out with the elephant. I wonder if that would oh, kind of help. Is this a classic Jigglypuff Dreamland counterpick? Oh, my goodness. I actually have no idea who's in favor in this matchup. I don't know. Who, I don't even know which person's playing which yet. I only watched H-Box against Falcons. We don't have any. We don't have puff players. I think. Other than soft and a couple others actually. I don't think of any. Oh yeah, Captain Falco. See, he plays Captain Falcon and Falco. Mm. Oh yeah, that was yeah, that was. His Truly thing. lives up to the tag. And T. Rar <laughs> plays Falco. I actually remember <laughs> fighting him at one of the uh, um, tournaments in uh, Modesto. Wow. The DSA, the the catch guard. Thing. I forgot to fight his top there. I know Hungrybox said going into uh, what was the summit, he feared only Wizbrobe. <laughs> Obviously, this is not Hungrybox, and that is not Wizbrobe, but I don't think Falcons complain about this matchup too much. Mm. Might. Nick says that yeah, he doesn't like this matchup. However, I, I haven't seen him lose to Soft yet, so until like, proven otherwise, I don't think. Falcon has really good throw follow-ups on Puff. Uh huh. He has guaranteed knees at a lot of percentages, I feel. Yeah. And just up air is always good versus flying characters. He has a lot of guaranteed knees against floaties. I think Marth has a few. Yeah, Falcon has some of the best like kill confirms on on throw versus floaties. Mm. But none on fast followers. Or it's like a read on that. Oh, wow. That was nice. Big moonwalk. Unexpected moonwalk. Pivot. Uh, oh. Ooh. Oh, Ooh. grab. Oh, accidental reverse. Yep. I always joke that Falcon's uh, recovery mix-up is getting reverse hit. <laughs> it's his only hope. It's his only mix-up. I don't know if he has any... And put it in that decision. <laughs> yeah, he just has to hold forward as much as he can. Yeah. Oh man, that's the classic Falcon bait. Double jump to bait, get up attack into knee. I did that uh, in middle school. Oh, you guys are just going at it. Okay. First knee. Yeah. Nice. There it is. That was the optimal percent. That barely Ooh, killed. That was the peak of the knee. Oh, that's, that's a set, I guess. I mean. Captain Falco takes it.